Hey you guys, what is up? Rook and Rider back here with another video on my PC and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to change your cursor into a crosshair on Windows 10. So yeah, let's get straight into the video. So first thing you want to do, you're going to want to come into your little search bar over here. You're going to want to type in settings. You're going to want to open your settings right here. Click open. I'm going to bring this right here. Okay, now that you're right here, you're going to want to search up cursor cur and then you just have to search up cur and then it's going to say change mouse pointer color and change mouse pointer size it doesn't matter which one you click on just click on any of them because it doesn't matter because you're going to want to come over here to where it says related settings and you're going to want to click on additional mouse settings i want to click on that and then it's going to bring you over here and then from here you're going to want to go on to additional mouse options and then it's going to bring this up, okay? It's going to bring this. Mouse properties is going to tell you buttons, pointers, point options, wheel, pointer. It's going to show you all this stuff. Don't worry about none of this stuff besides the one that says pointer. You're going to want to click on pointer. And then now it's going to show you this. Um, I don't think it's going to show your show you this one. But um, if you want to get a crosshair, you're going to want to, right here where it says normal select, you're going to want to double click on it. And then now it's going to bring this up. So you're going to, it shows you a bunch of all these different, different cursors that you could pick from. You could even choose a little pen if you wanted to. But today I'm going to be showing you how to do a crosshair. So you guys want to scroll until you start seeing a crosshair. Keep on scrolling right here. Okay, so there's a couple crosshairs actually. There's cross underscore I. There's this one, this one. And then these three right here but there is one thing about this that you guys need to know is that don't pick this one because as you can see this little line right here is shorter than this line and it looks rarely I mean it looks very funky you could say and then this one same thing this one's shorter than this line over here over here cross underscore R looks perfectly fine cross underscore RL kind of looks funky too and cross underscore rm kind of looks funky so the only ones you want to pick is either cross underscore i or cross underscore r the one i want to be picking is this one right here cross underscore i you're going to want to click on that oops <laughs> i think i messed up no actually yeah you're going to want to double click on it i'll show you guys again just scroll down until you find it again um yeah let's see where is it okay you just go on, you could either double click on it or just one click on it. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to double click on it. And then it's going to show me this right here. It's going to say normal select. And then once you have that, you're going to want to click over here, apply. You're going to want to wait for it to press apply. You can press OK. And then now you have this crosshair. You could come here. You could come here. And now you have this black crosshair. That's pretty darn cool. You could use it. Um, it's obviously just a regular crosshair. You could go into Google or whatever your browser is, and then you could just this is going to be your cursor. You could go into YouTube, you could it just looks it looks pretty cool, in my opinion. So, I just wanted to make a quick video because some a lot of people don't know how to do this. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to make this quick video. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, smash the like button, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace out.